what's up guys welcome back to everything wedding thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video we are excited to have you guys on our channel today we are always happy to have you here so guys if you're watching and you're not yet subscribed kindly consider subscribing to the channel you got nothing to lose also do not forget to give the video a thumbs up as that helps to grow the channel you can also share this video with your loved ones and leave me a comment in the comment section let me know which gown is your favorite for this particular video so in today's video as we get to enjoy these gorgeous gowns we're gonna be giving you some tips on the do's and don'ts for beach bound bride so if you're planning to have a beach wedding then this is your video so guys you are one lucky lady if your wedding is to be at the beach so whether it is at a far away exotic locale or a tropical beach closer to home this is easily one of the best wedding venues there is so romance is in the air as nature forms a beautiful canvas for your wedding your wedding guests will enjoy the holiday experience even as they frolic and have fun in the sun and sea nonetheless planning a beach wedding has its own set of challenges you have to account for various factors that are not present in other venues the warm and humid environment can cause a fair share of makeup and hair dress issues for a beach bride fortunately you can look gorgeous and plan a successful wedding with a few tips that we're gonna be sharing with you guys so the first tip is to consider the weather at the time of your wedding the weather at the beach isn't warm and humid all year round beach weather can also be dry windy with showers at various times of the year depending on the destination you pick it is a good idea to do some research on the weather that will be present at the time of your wedding if the beach will be windy you must adjust your outfit makeup and hairstyle to suit the weather consider accessorizing with a stall wrap or a jacket if it gets too cold Another tip is to not forget to choose the right fabric. Traditional wedding dress fabrics like organza and silk are not the best choices when it comes to a beach wedding because they can weigh you down, they can show sweat and become shabby in the sand at the beach. So it is wise to stay away from these types of fabric. Instead, choose the light and airy fabrics like chiffon for your wedding dress. These blend in beautifully with the setting and they are very comfortable to wear and convenient to carry. Other fabrics to consider are viol, organza and tulle. You also have to make sure that the fabric doesn't wrinkle easily. Your dress will be put through a lot of wear and tear so avoid fabrics like cotton and linen that wrinkle easily. Another tip is to pick the right silhouette. So the dress silhouette you choose has a very huge impact on your overall bridal look. The right silhouette will flatter your best features and will help you look gorgeous. So when your wedding is at the beach, don't let the location limit your choices. And if you start your search early, you will have time to find a dress that is going to look great while being in front of the beach. So start by identifying the, the best silhouette for your body type. Then you can find a dress that fits the bill. Another tip is do not overlook the importance of picking the right white. So one of the biggest advantages of an outdoor wedding is that your photographer can make the most of natural lighting. So this is a wonderful thing. However, it also means that your dress kindly may, may look different in this light from how you expect it to look in the artificial lighting. So consider this aspect when you're choosing the shade of white. So eliminate any likely issues by just making sure that the dress looks good in natural light prior to the purchase. So make sure that you pick the right white for your complexion so it flatters your skin tone. Another tip is to keep the skirt simple. Trust me when I say that it is not fun walking around in a dress that drags in the sun. Intricate details in the hemline and train can easily attract dirt and have sand stuck to it. So it can be difficult to clean afterwards. So keep the skirt of your dress simple to avoid such problems. It will be easier to move around in a light airy skirt. Additionally, it will also look fresh and clean throughout the day. 
when the skirt of your dress is simple. If you must have an embellished wedding gown, choose a dress with details in the bodies and waistline for best results. Another tip is don't forget to look out for the sun. So since your wedding is in the outdoors, it is natural that you will spend hours in the sun. So do not forget to protect yourself very well. You can use adequate amount of broad spectrum sunscreen on all the exposed parts of your body to stay sun safe. Pick makeup with sun protection for best results and also account for the effect of the sun when you choose the colors of your makeup. The natural light will emphasize pink and corals so pick them judicially and spot a natural look. It is best to keep the makeup light and just emphasize your features for best results. Another tip we are going to share with you guys is do not forget about the issues associated with transporting your dress. Unless your venue is near where you stay, you will have to travel with your wedding dress. It isn't easy to transport a gown which is so heavy and has intricate embellishment or is prone to wrinkling. Such, such factors can damage your dress so kindly pick a dress that travels well and you can eliminate likely issues we suggest that you choose uh, dresses from collections that are specifically tailored for destination weddings such gowns will be easy to pack they will be easy trans to transport and restore to original condition with minimum effort once you reach your destination And guys do not overlook the importance of your accessories so most beach brides opt for simple wedding dress for their beach weddings however that doesn't mean that you have to compromise on your bridal look because of the simplicity of the dress the right choice of accessories will help you to look beautiful pick colored gemstone jewelry for a pop of color or indulge in extra bling to sparkle on your special day the best part of choosing jewelry with sparkling stones is that they will reflect the natural light and look stunning in the venue you choose you can also go with pearl coral or rustic natural stones for an earthy vibe another tip is to use waterproof makeup so waterproof makeup is an absolute must for your beach wedding it will stay on despite the heat and keep you looking beautiful and fresh although you will have to touch up your makeup at regular intervals throughout the day waterproof makeup reduces the frequency of this task it is very important to use waterproof eyeliner mascara and eyeshadow this will help your eye makeup to stay on even if you shed copious tears of joys, choose colors like brown, navy, and olive instead of black in your eye colors for a sun-kissed effect. You also have to remember that humidity will affect your locks. Hair and humidity don't always go together. Beaches have high humidity levels and this can affect how frizzy your hair becomes. Keep this Keep this factor in mind when you plan your wedding day hairstyle. If your hair tends to freeze up when the air is moist, keep your hairstyle simple and collected. This will help you look fresh throughout the day. If your tresses aren't affected by humid environment, feel free to choose any hairstyle that you like. Avoid too many styling products that will weigh your hair down as this can ruin your look. A sleek and polished hairstyle may also look out of place in the cool, relaxed environment of a beach. So, please consider these factors when you choose your hairdo for the day. If you're having a beach wedding, kindly do not pick the wrong footwear. The uneven nature of the sand and turf at the beach makes Heels totally unsuitable for the occasion. Even if you have a wooden or cemented walkway for the ceremony, you will be walking in the sand at some time of the day. So ditch the heels and go barefoot. Adorn your feet with the choicest accessories like anklets to dress your feet in style. On our, or you can step your style with a bridal flip-flops or stylish sandals customized for the occasion. So guys, do not overdo the tan. Sun-kissed brides look wonderful nonetheless tan with caution. It is easy to go overboard and this can ruin all your makeup plans. Fake tanning lotions and spray-on tans are a huge mistake 
when your wedding is at the beach. So take on a garish orange hue in pictures and can make you look so funny. So if you must turn, do it in the safe and recommended way. Build up the foreglow by using the right products and obtaining the color gradually. So guys, the last tip is to remember to stay hydrated. The salt in the air in the beach environment can affect the texture of your skin. So moisturize well before you set out for the beach. It is equally important to stay hydrated on the inside too. Refresh yourself by drinking on water and other liquids throughout the day at your stay venue this will keep your skin looking fresh and it will also compensate for the loss of moisture in the salty environment and if you have oily skin it is likely that you will find it excessively oily in the natural environment make use of the blotting paper in your emergency kit to avoid this so guys, thank you so much for watching. If you find this video useful, kindly consider subscribing and hit the notification bell so that you're notified each time you upload. Guys, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I hope that I'll be able to see you guys on the next one.